Do you want to know the technique that people use to factor easily? Don't you have problems with math when they start talking about factoring? So this little course is going to introduce you how to factor easily. Hello, I'm Hugo Luke. Let's start. So what is the idea of following systems? Following systems. Most of students in factoring, they try to do stuff, but they don't follow a system. This video is just going is just to show you how to follow a system in which you can simplify and factor a polynomial quickly and easy. So I wanted you just imagine that we have here uh, a polynomial. So polynomial. And we need to factor the polynomial. We need to factor this polynomial. So the first idea, the first thing that you have to apply to factor a polynomial is to know how to find out the GCF. How to find out the GCF. So GCF. Start with your polynomial and find out the GCF. You have no idea how to find out the GCF. In the show, a minute with factoring, I will show you how to find out the GCF in one of the videos. Now, after you find out the GCF, the key, the key in this polynomial is always to check each factor. Okay, so we're factoring the polynomial. If we get two factors, check this factor, finish it, and then check this factor and finish it. Factor it completely. So you have the GCF. When you have the GCF, you have two terms, the GCF and another term. So you, you're going to the GCF, if it's not a monomial, and try to factor. And then go to the other term and check each step. Okay? After you apply the GCF to each factor, you just have to ask yourself if the new factor or factors has two terms. Okay? If the new factor has two terms, you just have to go to your special factoring formulas. Special factoring formulas um, okay it doesn't seem quite well uh, that's it so it's important for you to know the special factoring formulas have a flashcard and write it the difference of the squares the difference of cubes and the sum of cubes this is, these are the formulas when you have two terms. Then, if you have three terms, three terms, so you have three terms, it means that you have to factor trinomials. Okay? And how do you factor trinomials? So, you gotta check if it's a perfect square trinomial, okay? Or if it's our trinomials, trinomials using the form x squared plus bx plus c or a x squared plus bx plus c. The way to factor each trinomial, you can see it in another videos. In a minute with factoring. I will show you how to do how to factor trinomials. So you just have to wait. But the key here is to check that you have three terms. Go first to check if it's a perfect square trinomial, and then go to check each trinomial part. Okay. And if if 
you don't have three terms okay you check two terms three terms if you don't have three terms but four terms four terms so you have the option of factor by grouping factor by grouping okay so if you have four terms we have factor by grouping remember to check each new factor for example when you factor trinomials you can have two new factors maybe you will have a special factoring formula because you have binomials so you got to check this part to factor again or maybe you apply a special factoring formula and you get another special factoring formula when you factor it so you need to check again the special factoring formulas and when you have four terms maybe when you apply the factor by grouping you again have uh, a special factoring formula but this is the idea the idea is to check each factor after you apply the GCF see how many terms we have and then apply the system okay to follow the system is so easy polynomial GCF count the terms go to each term and apply the method that is required go find the method that is required find the steps to apply it and just apply this is the system that I follow to factor to factor polynomials completely and it's really it really helps me and uh, it's really helping many students okay that's enough for today thanks for watching I hope that you enjoyed it send me your comments maybe you want an special an special uh, algorithm you want to to see how to apply one of the steps so send me an email send me a uh, send me your comments and I will be glad to help you goodbye